What's up people and welcome back to part 22 of our Hogwarts Legacy walkthrough. It's been a while. Revelio. We left off and um, what were we doing? We were in astronomy class I believe. And looking at what we could do. And then we have this second creep uh keeper trial. I also see in this, which I'm liking the look of, Crucio. But I think for the moment we're gonna go up to Hogsmeade to Serona and see what she's looking for. That's been there for a while. Wouldn't mind getting it out of the way. I think there's also another one with Natty. So that would be good to do as well. It always seems to be a it seems was, all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Nice. It always seems to be a pretty good mission. When um Natty is involved, but we'll see what this is about anyway. Glad you came. Hello, Sorona. I received your owl. How are you? Hello, my friend. Did you ever find Lord Gog? I did, thank you. In fact, we're working together to try and rein in Ramrock. Are you? Hmm. I suspected you and he would get along. Perhaps best I don't know details of your plans. Then I shall refrain from telling you to be careful yet again. But I hope you will be. I, of course. Your owl mentioned you're needing my help with something? I do. I thought you might be just the person to do a favour for my friend Dorothy Sprottle in Upper Hogsfield. Hmm. I don't believe I've met Mrs. Sprottle. She's lovely. Her late husband, Aidan, was a friend of my father's. In fact, I'd stay with Dot and Aidan the summers I waited tables here as a student. I've seen her a few times since Aidan passed, but the pub's been so busy lately, I've not been as attentive as I'd have liked. I wonder if you might pop in and see her. She may need some help collecting ingredients for her supply of Wigan World potion. And you could retrieve something of mine in the process. A box, um, full of old letters and such. <laughs> I'll try to go and see her when I can. It would mean the world to me and to Dorothy. Aidan was bringing the box of letters to me when he was taken ill. Doc can tell you where he might have dropped it. You'll find the hamlet just north of Hogsmeade. Please do give Dot my love. Okay. Not very exciting for the moment anyway. Doesn't seem like. He was asking me to go up here. Definitely excited to learn Crucio. More excited than more excited than I am to um, come up here, but you never really know what's going on. Does it get on. any more cozy than Hogsmeade? Oh, he needs to stop. Give over. Anyway, I think I might also. I'm gonna switch this around i'm gonna go for i'm gonna go for a what's this thank you i'm gonna go for descendo instead and um like that and then maybe like that. Now, I am a fan of in Incendio. It's just feel a bit limited when you're using it sometimes because you have to be close. I'm not sure if I like this, but just wouldn't mind switching it up. Can we use a room? We can. 
Let's go. I'm seeing these balloons everywhere. I'm this just wondering place has seen days. how many time trials there is just all ah, over. At the Hogsfield. Now where to find Mrs. Bottle? Grab this. It's like a place right out of a store. Shane Bardolf thought dark magic was the answer. I reckon Rookwood's played a hand in his disappearance. Hello, Mrs. Bottle. Actually, Serona Ryan asked if I'd come and see you. Oh, dear Serona, a gem has been for as long as I've known her. She thought you might need help collecting ingredients for your Wiganwell potion. And she's correct. My darling Aiden used to collect hawk lumps for me. Since he died, my supply has dwindled. I'm sorry for your loss, Mrs. Bottle. Oh, thank you. Love of my life. A bit lost without him. If you wouldn't mind gathering some hawk clumps for me, I'd be happy to compensate you for your time. Do I have them with me? I don't know. Um, I can certainly try and find some for you. That would be wonderful. I'm worried about the traveling vendors and would love to get the more Wiganworld potion. Serona also mentioned that Mr. Sprottle was bringing her a box of letters when he fell ill. Indeed he was. I'd almost forgotten. I stumbled upon it just before Aiden died. He was hoping to go through it with Serona over a butterbeer or two. Uh, those two were always like two bow truckles in a branch. Aiden took ill when he was collecting hawk clumps on his way to see her. He made it home, but I fear he dropped the box in the cavern. The cavern is in the hills just southwest of our hamlet. You can gather hawk clumps and collect the box of letters there. Thank you, Mrs. Brottle. Thank you. I'll be here if you are able to collect those hawk clumps. I and the vendors I help would greatly appreciate it. Bardo Beaumont should have returned by now. Had my dog Now wizard. we're going into a cavern. Likely this astronomy table will be best used when it's dark. Oh yeah, night time, yeah. Hmm. We'll leave them for the time being. Perhaps I shall scout around Fellcroft for something to poach. Uh, poachers. This must be the cavern Mrs. Spotton mentioned. I'll check it. Thought we'd forget oh. about that common hell you stole. It isn't Nora Treadwell's guardian. Enjoy stealing hippogriffs. Hey. You'll have to fight it next thing. Descender. Still got it. Still got it. I reckon we should give these boys a go before we uh, continue on. You've made a mistake. Never. That's 
the combo I was trying to get going for myself. But it wasn't really happening. Any loot for me? Collection update ambush. Um, what's this? Ah, we got our potion back, so. It's all fair. Got our potion back and we got rid of some poachers. Enter. Let's have a look see around. What this is see about the whole clumps and the box of letters. Couldn't bring them. That over the way. That's all the whole clumps for now. Mrs. Sprottle should be pleased. Revelio. Ah. How we feel about swimming in this, but. Let's keep a put. Ooh. Such a good. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, no, no. We can't do that. Oh, no, thank you. Right, let's get out of here. It wasn't too much damage anyway, but. Oh, we're all over the place a bit. There we go. And ten for that dive. On we go. So big out. Big out. Cavern, I must say. Fight that troll, or we do it together. Too late for a boy. Oh, that not good. Delay between that last one. Actually. Oh, I don't know how we have the jet. I don't know how we have the jet. 
Not good. That's foul, hulking brute. Not good at all. What's this? Didn't really is. I think you use some of that to make um to make the heal healing potions where I need it. Grab some of these, make it worth our while. and stuff. Different places there are to go, so I'm not missing out on anything. I mean, we must be down here at least. Ten minutes and we've not even, um, not even found one page yet. Which is alright. No complaints. Climbing. Oh, here we go. I conjured this wee gift for you as a token of my gratitude if you hadn't stood your ground on my behalf during Quidditch practice last week. I might have left the team altogether and now we've won the Quidditch Cup. Ravenclaw House would not be the same without you. You are sincerely Sean. Did I pick that up? Oh, okay. Well, I'm not going to read all that. Out loud, at least. This must be Serona's box of letters. Exit the Forbidden Forest. Okay. I should find Mrs. Brottle. She'll be glad to get these hawk lumps. Yeah. She'd want to make it worth my while, I tell you that. Never anything about a troll in the description. This looks intriguing. Shane Bardolf thought dark magic was the answer. I reckon Rookwood's play. Hello, Mrs. Sprottle. I have good news. I was able to harvest some hawk lumps for you, and I found Sorona's box of letters. Oh, thank you. How wonderful. The traveling vendors will be thrilled to replenish their stock of wig and weld potion. And Serona will be delighted to have those letters. How kind of you. Now you be careful heading back to Hogsmeade. I should take this box of letters to Serona. She'll be glad to have it back. Excuse me, did you say something about Bardolf Beaumont? Oh, hello again. How nice to see you. And yes, I did. I was just worrying about Claire Beaumont's brother, Bardolf. Only he's gone missing. Rumor is he was seen in the forest practicing dark magic. Saw him myself near some ruins with Rookwood's lot I did. I fear he got himself into trouble with the Ashwinders, especially if he made them a promise he couldn't keep. I'd help search for him myself, but no one will risk encountering Ranrock's loyalists. They seem to be everywhere. 
I can certainly look out for him. Any help would be appreciated. You might speak to Claire first. Perhaps she has some insights that I don't. I can tell you that Bardolf was last seen in the forest wearing a particular woolen jumper, one that Claire knitted herself. Claire will be at her shop if you'd like to speak with her. I'll be honest with you, I was only talking to her because um, I wanted to know what the story was with my reward, but... Looks me. My boy thought I was getting potions out doing all that. Apparently not. Do I not? Um. Do I not give this stuff to? To Serona now. Um, I'm confused. I am, to be honest with you. I'm just going to go back. Just to see. I mean, maybe I don't have. Maybe I don't have to be the one to give it to her. But let me check the quest to see if it's done. Brother's keeper. Okay. Yeah. I was gonna say. Oh, see that's <laughs> me. Me present L one is from uh, Seven Doors. I keep trying to sprint. Hello, Sorona. I have good news. I was able to provide your friend Mrs. Sprottle with some hawk clumps for her Wigamel potion, and I found your box of letters. Oh, thank you. I knew you were the one to ask. I'm glad I could be of help. Mrs. Sprottle sends her best. Don't know what I'd have done without her and Aiden. Thank you, again, for helping her, and for returning this box of letters. It's nice to reflect on good memories. And just like that, we have another quest done. See what's next on the agenda. Um, this, which I'm not looking forward to, to be honest with you. Um, discovered what happened to Bard of Beaumont. What time are we at now? 20 minutes. Hmm. The only thing I don't like about the demi guys is um oh, I keep doing it. Yeah, the only thing I don't really like about the demi guys is um Revelio. It tells you but well, sometimes there's an audio if you're near. Um the demi guys, but it's not always easy to tell exactly where it is, you know? I mean, is it in here? It could be. But it also could not be. Hmm. I think... That I want to... Learn to do Crucio. Mm. For that, actually, let me just. 
just check if I have him. Um... Hold on a sec. I'll just check my gear. It's actually higher. Take them off my face, not like that. I need to identify them too. Pieces. I will do that shortly. And outfit. No, we're all good. I am ah. Oh, if I do that one more time, I swear. Apparently not. He doesn't even want to say hello. Oh, I keep doing it. Keep doing it. Can't learn. Anyway, I think what I'm actually gonna do is just Hello there, come on in. Plenty to look at here. Get rid of these pieces of clothes. Not the unidentifiable ones anyway. And then I'm going to end the episode here. I can do to help. And in part 23, we will learn the Crucio Curse. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.